Hey guys, want to make a video about these uh, two fan accessory accessories. Uh, this is uh, the common white diffuser, and this is the traffic one. Uh, I don't have the package uh, for this uh, this one because I <laughs> lost it. I have this uh, for a long time now, so. Let's take a look first. Uh, you can see it has some uh, indentations inside. Just to uh, touch it, attach it to the uh, flashlight itself. This is uh, almost the same as this one, but with a bright orange uh, color and it's uh, obviously <laughs> it's almost the double uh, in length as you can see the model number is AD201 and it's compatible for with LD10, LD20, PD20 and PD30 they are quite cheap so I decided to first buy this one. Uh, I think that it's the most useful for at least for me. Um, I found this on a really uh, good price, so I decided to buy it also. Let's take out from the from the package. In the back part of the packaging, it says uh, Phoenix Traffic One can convert your flashlight into a glowing orange high visibility one. It's the best option for emergency situations and traffic control. It's made of PC of PC twenty eight oh five plastic. Uh, has twenty one point five millimeters in diameter. And it's compatible with the models that I already told you that there are the LD10, LD20, PD20, and PD30. So, as you may or may not know, I am uh, probably owner of Phoenix uh, LD20. By the way, this is a Hudson. Pouch, it's great pouch, has a super a superb quality. Uh, I think it's for magazines, but I can't remember. I bought it a long time ago. So this is my PD all uh, the LD20. Sorry, has. Um, Just a low mode. Let's turn the lights off. Uh, if you press it again, it's a little bit. It's a medium uh, height, and if you rotate the vessel, it's a turbo height. At the maximum of, can remember. Uh, give me just one second. box right over here so as you can see it's 205 lumens but anyway if you want to a review of this uh, flashlight made by me right down below so anyway if you um, lock the bezel and you have the turbo mode and you uh, click one more time 
you have the strobo and with without the uh, the lock vessel you have three modes as you can see and the SOS as you can see I'm not touching the <laughs> the switch so anyway basically I'm gonna grab the diffuser and complete the dark I have no lights on my room so as you can see it's really great for using like a torch you have the traffic horn it's amazingly strong it's almost a, a lightsaber so uh, if you want a traffic horn you can buy this or if you want to uh, practice uh, Jedi arts I guess <laughs> also you can uh, buy one of these Of course, all the modes work with this uh, add-on. That's a cool SOS in a safety orange ultra bright. So anyway, let's wrap this up. So guys. I think I already cover all the aspects of these uh, two items. Uh, the reason that I'm doing this video now it's because I'm building a consistent EDC system, a uh, more evolved system than the one you see on the on the previous video. Uh, it will be um, several modules and these uh, two items will be uh, uh, important part of one of them so look for for that series I will be I don't know uh, maybe one two weeks I don't know I'm working I I, I really want to um, find uh, the 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 right uh, pouches and um, items etc. Now I'm gonna give you a I um, would say the teaser. <laughs> this is the pouch that I'm working right now. You can recognize some of the objects. Um, these two items goes in here with the LD20. Um, so look forward for that series. Um, enough, enough talking. So as always, thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. If you're not a subscriber, please click that button that says subscribe. Um, leave a comment down below come on uh, rate mm, I already told you subscribe and comment so I guess that's all now I'll see you in the next bye bye